In this lesson, we learn about the impact of agriculture in our daily life. We will consider life in the United States, developing countries, and the world. Let's take a look at agriculture in the United States and how it affects our people. Agriculture is the largest industry in the United States, providing employment for about 20% of the population. 20%? That would be two people out of 10 employed in agriculture. Remember, our definition of agriculture includes not just farmers and ranchers and fishermen, but also the people in industries that serve farmers and ranchers and fishermen, plus the people who process the products of agriculture and deliver to the end users. Farmers and ranchers make up less than 1% of the American population. When the United States was formed, our first president, George Washington, was also a farmer, as well as about 99% of the population. Most of our elected politicians of that time were farmers. Farming is the occupation of up to 80% of the population in some developing countries at this time. Most of them are women and children. The Food and Agriculture Organization of the United Nations reports that over 1 billion people are employed in world agriculture, representing one in three of all workers. 97% of all farms and ranches in the United States are family owned. Only 3% are owned by large corporations. Farmers, ranchers, and fishermen are diverse, growing conventional, biotech, and organic products. In the United States, there are 2.2 million U.S. farms and ranches, 3.2 million U.S. farm and ranch operators. There are 969, 672 women. 99,734 are Spanish, Hispanic, or Latino. 44,629 are African American. And 58,475 are American Indian. In the United States, each farm or ranch produce enough food and fiber for 169 people. Farmers and ranchers receive only 17 cents out of every retail dollar spent on food. United States consumers spend on average just 6.1% of their income on food each year. But that figure is an average. Even in the wealthy United States, we have families struggling to pay for a healthy food supply. In the world, Despite international efforts to address food insecurity, around 108 million people living in 48 food crisis countries were at high risk of or already facing severe acute food insecurity in 2016. Agricultural research and a healthy food supply have contributed to a much higher life expectancy in the United States. The current world population of 7.3 billion is expected to reach 8.5 billion by 2030 and 9.7 billion in 2050. There is a lot of discussion in the agricultural community about how we can feed that many people in 2050. If you choose a career in agriculture, you may be challenged to help solve the hunger problem. There is a free lesson plan for What is Agriculture? complete with all the videos, worksheets, lab exercise, crossword puzzle, word search, and teacher's guide with answer key. To download the lesson plan, go to www.spernbergschool.com. Click the link for list of lessons. 
On the list of lessons site, locate and click the lesson plan for 6002, What is Agriculture? That link will open your browser to my store on Teachers Pay Teachers, where you can download the free lesson plan. Thanks for listening. Thank you.